Hi, I'm Susan and welcome to my channel, Honey and Me. In this video, I want to share a place that we found to stay in Texas. This place is on Highway 290, which is off of I-10. It's an overlook rest area that was spectacular. We found it on the iOverlander app, which is our favorite app for finding free places to stay overnight. This rest area offers covered picnic tables and garbage cans, as well as a place to have a barbecue. There's no bathrooms, no water, no electricity. It's in the middle of nowhere, and it's so fabulous. It was pretty quiet while we were there. A few people stopped in to take in the view, and a few people spent the night. We spent two very peaceful, relaxing days and nights there, and we're kind of sad to leave. Welcome to Lancaster Overlook. It does say that there is no turnaround for vehicles with trailers, but we had no problem turning our pickup truck with a 25 foot trailer behind it around. The parking lot was empty, so there was no worries about trying to maneuver between parked cars. So if you come in here and you've got a vehicle that you feel you can turn around in this area with, I would go ahead and do it because you really do have quite a bit of room. The sign is only as you come into the parking area though. It's a little late once you've gotten to the sign. You've already turned the corner and come in here. It's kind of in the wrong place. We just made sure that when we came in, we turned around and got pointed in the right direction to get out again. So it wouldn't really matter how many other vehicles were in the parking lot.
I took the dogs for a little explore and found a dirt road leading off of 290, just west of the overlook. Look at these beauties. Oh my goodness, aren't they gorgeous? That right down there is Fort Lancaster State Park, which was closed when we came by. I'm assuming it's closed for the season, unless it's closed on Saturdays and Sundays maybe, which would seem kind of weird. But this right here is the road that we came up to get out of the valley to get up to the Fort Lancaster lookout. And I am on the other side of the oh valley, I guess, from where the lookout is. I thought I was going to be able to see where we were in the trailer over there, but I've come too far, so we're going to have to go backtrack. But I just wanted to show you this spectacular view. It's overcast today and isn't going to get past 25 Celsius, I think, today, but that's warm enough. And we're going to hang around at this lookout for another day because it was so peaceful last night. All you could hear was crickets, literally crickets. The odd car goes by at night, but it's a back road, back highway, so there's not a lot of traffic. It was really, really nice. Watch your nose, Fred. You can see us way over there. So there's the road that we took up. So here's a better view. There's the valley that we came out of. And we went up the road, bit of a hill. And right over there is the lookout, which you can stay at for free and have a beautiful view of the valley and gorgeous sunsets, all for free. And look at this. I mean, that's a lot of rocks to put in place to hold the road up. Those are all rocks. Crazy. So there's more of that rock retaining thing, rock retaining wall. There's a car coming along. that rock retaining wall. That's so impressive. Just incredible how much work that would have taken. <sighs> now we're going to walk back to the trailer and have a cup of tea, dogs have a drink of water, and relax. Here's some more of those beautiful red cactus flowers. I'm gonna have to go back and find out what kind of cactus this is because it is stunning. Oh, and those sunsets I mentioned? We really enjoyed our free camping at the Lancaster Overlook. 
and plan to return if we're ever in the area again, as well as plan our trip so that we're not there on one of the days that Fort Lancaster is closed because from what I've seen on the internet, it looks really cool. Maybe we'll see you there. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye now.